Welcome back guys to another episode of Adventures of David and Aaron. If this is your first time to our channel, I am David. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button, give this video a thumbs up, and enjoy our adventures as we explore Rosarito, Mexico. Baja California. It's twice as big as Florida. It's a hundred miles longer than Italy. But I'm here to talk to you about what to expect when we reach San Isidro. So the bus is going to stop and everybody will have to take everything out of the bus. Now some of you went uh, on our day trip to uh, Rosarito Beach <coughs> and uh, some of you left sweaters and coats on the coach and as a result everybody had to stop and had to go back on and get off with everything so let's do a right when they want everything off the bus they want everything off the bus you can't leave anything on here we're going to take our bags and uh, they probably won't inspect them but there is a form that they will hand that we have to fill out so if you have, you know, a pen, it would be nice to have everything ready beforehand. Boy Scouts and Girl Scouts have the same motto, be prepared. If you don't have a pen with you, Ramon says that they will supply you with a pen. The sooner we get through this, the sooner we can get, in fact, uh, uh, we're making such good time that we'll be able to get to the hotel and you'll have maybe an hour and a half to refresh yourselves and, and uh, get ready for uh, a wonderful lobster lunch or dinner. In my case, it'll be dinner. I, I won't want anything after that. And we'll talk about Rosarita Beach. We'll talk about Tijuana. And we'll talk about Puerto Nuevo once we cross the border. But this is the first stage. Remember, there's three. Crossing the border, getting to our hotel, and then Puerto Nuevo. I always uh, figure that if there's a big delay or something, we can always go right to Lobster Village, but they say be there about 2.30. Sunday in Mexico is a huge restaurant day. Uh, same in the United States, I think you see a lot of Hispanics uh, at restaurants in the morning having brunch. Uh, but we have, uh, we, we have certain seats that we wanted to reserve and they were by the window, so you can see, so they're gonna have all that ready for us at 2.30.
7038 the Rosarito Beach Hotel. This is what the interior hallways of the hotel look like. Elevators, stairwell, and room 703. This is the view that you are greeted with as you enter the room. You have your restroom to the left. Pretty nice spacious restroom. Double queen beds. Tile floor. With a balcony. And nice flat screen TV and a desk. Very nice room, very nice accommodations. Beachfront. Small balcony. Right above the pool guys and the pier. guys so we're exploring downtown Rosarita Mexico then you have people behind you Are you selling chicken, senor? Si, sí, senor. Where'd you order? Michelada for you. Ah, gracias, amigo. Over there. Okay guys, so we are off for some lobster dinner. What up man? You don't find hand hand work like you do in, in these countries. Um, load up, come out here and load up on uh, pots and fountains and about 30 restaurants. This this town of Puerto Nuevo is strictly built for restaurants. You don't want to be with the spring break partiers. This is for adults. Okay guys, we're putting in a huevo. We're getting ready to do a lobster dinner here at Ortega's restaurant. Villa Ortega's Puerto Nuevo in Rosarito, Mexico. Check out this restaurant. Awesome design. <laughs> Right on the ocean. Hi, Mom. Hi. Say hello, YouTube. Hello, YouTube. And our window view of the ocean. How's your soup? Fantastic. And what type of soup is it? It's tortilla soup. It's a little different than what you buy. Yes, it 
fries have arrived and tortillas and we're waiting on our lobster and these margaritas are amazing.